Hey guys, Potates here. I have some really interesting content to show you for Monolith's new game, Shadow of War. First, I'll be showing you how the Blood Brothers mechanic works. Next, I'll be showing you how the decoy ability works, followed by the new way time advances and some other goodies. Enjoy! Eat them. Eat them. <laughs> Be careful who you kill in Shadow of War, for he may have a blood brother. They will hunt down Talion when their brother is killed, seemingly becoming more powerful in order to get revenge. Maybe you won't see me again, but there's someone who will come for you. He is my brother by blood, and he will come for yours. If you have a blood brother in your army, be sure to not get it killed, because that will drastically increase the chance of that orc betraying you. Inversely, if you save an orc's blood brother, that will drastically increase his loyalty. And you won't bring my brother back. And it might put a smile on his ghost. All these choices will be remembered in the end as unique dialogue. Even Ali struggled to kill this blood brother, eventually dying at the end of the stream to it. That's that is what right. you get for killing an Uruk's blood brother. You monster. Careful in Mordor, haven't you? You like never it. know who's got a big brother. Keen for revenge. <laughs> We know that orcs can have the ability to lead a gang in Shadow of War, but some orcs have the ability to lead a gang of virtually identical orcs, making it extremely difficult to know where the real captain is. The only giveaway is that they are weaker than their leader. Seen here is a chase event, where one decoy leads an enemy into a group of other decoys and the real captain. When Talion blows up some grog and kills them, they have the same camera pan as when a real captain dies. This will make for some fantastic siege battles, as a player will not be sure which orc is the real captain, drastically slowing them down and probably making you win. Very, very cool. As you may or may not have noticed, now when Talion completes a mission, time will advance for select missions in the region. Each mission has three bars, and after the last bar is depleted, if time advances again, that mission will resolve, with or without Talion's help. Time does not advance for regions Talion is not in. This is much different to Shadow of Mordor, where time only advanced when you manually made it so, or died. I personally think this is a welcome change, as the world will seem more alive without you. Maybe Monolith realized that we were kind of just getting ourselves killed to advance time. Vedic, I think you want me to kill you. A cheap thrill for the death maker. Well, get someone else to do it. In Shadow of Mordor, the only way to get dismounted off a mighty Graug was to get you or it killed. As seen in my last video, Shadow of War has new tricks to dismount you though. As we can see, Karagors can jump up and bite Talion in the face. Karagors get hungry too, you know. So let's break up all this series with a bit of YouTube fun. Turn on subtitles and listen to this scene. This foe is beyond us, Killer Brimble. Not with the spirit of Kana at our side. His food is beyond us, Killer Brimble. Not with the spirit of common cancer. <laughs> Gold. So guys, I thought I'd mention something that I have noticed in hopes that I would reach a few people. Recently, I've been receiving a bit of hate for supporting this game. Just so you know, my videos aren't sponsored and never have been. 
Some people seem to think because I am excited for this game that I'm part of the problem and I'm supporting evil. That can't be further from the truth. What these people need to realize is that the game is an art form. Art has no morality. If someone evil employs a painter to make a work of art, should that not be appreciated? Should that art not be appreciated? Shadow of War has, what, hundreds of people working on it for over three years now? These people all have families, they have dreams, they have hopes. You think this is what that courageous man wanted? His game to be boycotted just because his bosses want to make money off of it? You'll hurt the little guys who poured all their time and heart into this more than you hurt the fat cats. Well, whatever your personal viewpoints are, let's try to leave politics out of this. I'm really excited for this game and I have every right to be. So thanks again for watching guys, I truly appreciate all the support you've been giving me. I have a ton of new Shadow of War content coming out very soon, so if you haven't already, subscribe, leave a comment and a thumbs up really helps. So now I'll leave you with some interesting orc clips. I'm Potates, see you soon! Surely this is the end, but not for me, chum! Oh no! And he's death defying! Wow. Sometimes you need your own tailor uh, for your Italian suits. You want to look good? Yeah. yeah I serve you, Bright Lord! Lord sounded, reinforcements arrived, and our enemy just chewed through them? That's just as well. I rushed here when I heard the alarm, not knowing what I would find. Seeing you, I can't believe my good fortune. two halves of the same orc. That's why they said we were special. Right out of the bat, they said it. Twice the intellectual <laughs> prowess, twice the cunning, and twice the intimidating yet noble visage. Hey, it's an important part of the rules. Oh, she has to kill him? Yes. Uh, well, he's dead. So that's one. one. That is one. Do we have any number? I lay in the mood close to death. Skak the twins is back! So my brother Merc coaxed the life back into me. <laughs> so now we will coax the death into you! Ah, there he is. He's after me! There we go. I feel like you should say he's after me. No, now we've got him in it! Okay. Nine. He can't come back. I mean, that's not Oof. It's over for you. There are more than enough of us to grind you to pulp. <laughs> That the bloody lumpy kind of pulp, and I'm gonna slurp it up when they're done. <laughs> is a man. The man will always lose. That's right. You're just a pathetic man. 